I'm really proud to be a part of working with Specsavers and Kidscape to bring more awareness to bullying because, you know, as I've said, it is something that I've gone through myself, I can relate and I do feel obligated if there's anything I can do to help, of course I want to do that. And I was just really intrigued because when I think back to how many years ago when I was being bullied, there was never anything like this around. And sitting today and actually being a part of the course, the way that it was explained to the kids, you know, how to handle situations, the psychology behind it, and there were just certain techniques uh, that were being spoken about today and talked about. And I thought, you know what, if I knew that 20 years ago, it would have made a massive difference and I could have handled things in a very different way. Knowing the statistics of afterwards of how many kids it's actually helped, like a 95% rate difference is just incredible. I went through very different types of bullying when I was a kid, but I think the worst part of it all for me that took me the longest to get over was just the general fear. And I hated feeling like that because I was never a weak person, I was very strong. Um, and I just felt like eventually it began really breaking me down. My one piece of advice, and I think most important piece of advice that I would give to kids out there being bullied is don't be afraid to speak to someone, talk to someone, talk to an adult, talk to a teacher, talk to a family member, talk to a friend, because this can be changed, this can be helped this situation you're in, but you've got to speak up and you have to reach out and tell someone. And don't feel ashamed, remember it's not you that's the problem, it's the bully, so don't ever forget that.